So it is my great pleasure to present, thank you, yeah, to present uh, Soraya Domina Lazaro, who is a phenomenal nonfiction writer, just, you know, from what I know, uh, <laughs> and is the author of the self-published chat books, Bullets and Butterflies, Chicanas, and Chakras, and she received her bachelor's degree in English from Mills College and is currently in the MFA in writing program here at the California College of the Arts, woo! Um, her poetry has been published in a lot of places. <laughs> um, and um, she's been in uh, Latino literature and anthologized in Canos, the, an anthology of anesthetic writing in she is a Vona alum and a Pisces and writes to heal and empower herself and is just a wonderful person who's not going to be mad that I mispronounced a lot of those words. Woo! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm so like blessed to be here. It's been a beautiful two years and like I really want to thank Denise Newman uh, for my mentorship and like Joseph and Opal. Um, it's been amazing and just like everybody in the, my cohort, um, you guys really changed me and I'm a different person <laughs> from two years ago. It's just been really cool. Um, I'm gonna read the poems from my thesis. They kind of tell a story, um, they speak to each other, but they're also at the same time, um, I'm still writing it, so I don't think it's uh, totally done yet. <laughs> um, the first piece is called Kelp, so I think I'll just read them, say the title, and just go with the flow with it, so. Um, kelp. Don't hurry, space muscle. Love bound, light beam. Tentacles tangling. Out of all people, do we come together? Skinny, linking arms across the grass. Hurricane wonder. Pale blue sky, wandering warrior. Lucid carriage, single, pins and needles, a desire. A boy recycles cans by dusk. In my association, light flashes. My mother will be gone four nights out of the week. Flip phone from a corner store as shame slides. Lineage weakened, garlic bulbs, plucked earth, cans crushing vanished, stacked and stacked. He's a collector that divvies patchwork in the darkest corners. Um, this is called Glitter and Magic. I was broke, couldn't ride the train, had him waiting like Van Gogh for paint to dry. I was broken, came out to my dad with a new name. New name edged, let go like crazy legs, like a wet leaf stuck to shoes. I don't write for you. I write for glitter and magic, and my last name is what's left. Um, this is called Earth and Face, and it's kind of about microaggressions. You're so much darker than the last time I saw you. It, it was winter the last time you saw me. She was a therapeutic herbalist who makes $75 oils for hands, feet, neck, and face, pushing her words like maps, pin me. It looks like you just got back from Mexico. She thinks she can say that, or she had a Mexican nanny, or recovering from Drake, all the beer, gardens, all the sweets, foreigner. Take this, pressing finger pads into pores, my pores, my color, all the scars. Looking at her porcelain, silver glitter purses for tiny shoulders, crystalline, kaleidoscope skin, moon tattoo, window seal. Brown, brown, brown developed, brown, brown glowing. Sad brown girl cruising down the street in the back of a pickup truck, teased hair. Sad brown girl reaching over mountains of men, jellyfish sandals. Um, the way we were light and the way we were shadow 
and you said we only had two options, and both seemed impossible. And then I took a bite and linked my eyes, and if we could, let's go back to when we first tried. I will shake pain and comfort fragments and dance a shameless dance and dance like no one is looking and ink triangles on wrists and lose in boxing rings. If we could remember the light of language, make me forget why. Um. This is called uh, Lessons in Curating Impulse. He wants to write a play about Latino and white dynamics. I am brainstorming scenes where we gesticulate making out, but I can't find one. My throwback Thursday photos are of yoga pants or somebody else's succulents. I used to take walks at dusk in the summer and clip succulents from neighbors' yards, and months later I saw a sign, please don't take clippings. I am not sure if that would be in the play about Latino and white dynamics. <laughs> I do not remember his smell anymore. No, I so do remember. It was a knockoff cologne and deodorant that drove me batshit crazy. The entire week I refused to wash my clothes. I was obsessed with the stages of his smell fading away on my shirt, a shirt that costs more than a week's worth of almond milk lattes, even though I am not lactose. Drinking from his smell, what would that look like in a scene? We, were, we could never write for the stage. We are playing Trotsky and Frida white honey mountain, buttocks to grab and pounce. We are all substance applied to the body, the body. Frida Kahlo was not just about her lovers. I never found her blue house in Coyacan. I'm prone to getting lost when looking for something important. Thanks. Um, I've got to read a few more. Thanks. Um, this one's called Silence. I put my hand on the Shruti box. He put his hand on mine. No, this way. He insists I'm not pushing hard enough. The Shruti box is not a sound. The Shruti box is not a note, but the sound of two fearful lovers going up the ladder into a starry sky. He does not tell me ever. He has never told me ever. The heart is hard. Olna. Olna, Olna, I am forgetting what I said goodbye to. Make me, me again. Stay on the ride, even if you're upside down. Reach for me. Okay, thank you. <laughs>